welcome to Jamie Loving All Seasons. And we are here today with something a little different. I finally got my coffee bar area, as you can see a little bit behind me, together. The way I want it, I love it. So, this video today is I did a two-tier tray. So that'll be after we go over the coffee bar area. And I have a little haul. I didn't see too much new stuff in my stores yet. But guess what I did see? Today is the Friday before Mother's Day. Not Friday. Today's Thursday. Okay, today's Thursday. <laughs> and tons of stuff marked down. Lots of Ray Dunn. So if there's things you've been eyeing and you're like, eh, I think I'll wait, I'll wait. Check it out. A lot of markdowns. But if you are new to my channel, I love decorating for all seasons and I love Ray Dunn. I love shopping hauls. I love um, shop with me's and DIYs. So with that being said, I'm going to show you real quick a couple of the items I got, which I'm pretty excited. Um, first one is going to be I got for my stepmom. So I always give her a gift card so she can kind of get what she wants. But I like to give her a little something. And for some reason, when I saw this, I really thought of her. And I think the biggest thing is navy is her color. Okay, that is her color. And with that being said, she's not, I don't think she's a huge Ray Dunn fan. But this is just really cute. She can have it sitting out for the spring, for the summer, you know, and it's just the little teapot. It's a birdhouse and it was only $16. This is at TJ Maxx. Tons of stuff on sale, guys. It has the black writing, white. It is just, I think it's adorable. So I hope she likes it just as much as I did for her. All right, next item, super excited, my first birdhouse. And you want to know why? Five dollars, guys. And look what's on the back. I think the reason it says rest in the black writing, and I love this shape. This is probably my favorite shape. And I think this had the baby bird house with it and they didn't have it so that's my guess why it was five dollars and I was like yes please I'll take it but I love that look at the little birds they're like kissing that's me and my husband right there just kidding but anyways as you guys can tell I'm in a good mood today I was super excited I actually was returning items again returning stuff and of course I come out with more. This one is not a Ray Dunn item, but I have been eyeing this birdhouse. Look at how pretty that is. I, don't, I want you guys to see the detail. Hopefully you could see it. My light is kind of washing it out. This was TJ Maxx, $8. But that is just so pretty to me and this will be nice for the spring, for the summer, I, I mean, I really love this one. This is, I've been wanting this. So when it was on sale, I was like, yeah, I'll take it. I'll take it. Now, this one was not on sale. It's the baby canister. I love it with sugar. So I have a sugar container over here, but I kind of wanted something a little larger. So this was perfect. This was $9.99. That light TJ Maxx and it has the long lettering with the flatter top love it all right then I have one item from Marshall's you guys know these are $5.99 stay sassy that is me my husband always says I'm being sassy <laughs> I really love that one that says uh, sassy classy fabulous but I can't, I haven't seen it yet. So close enough. 
I snagged this one for me. Happy Mother's Day. I also bought myself some clothes and shoes today. Happy Mother's Day. You guys, this I grabbed because you you see it's the ant like that amber looking glass. The fall, of course. $4.99. This was home goods. Um I can't really tell exactly what it says, but I just I love that. If you can guys, if you guys can see. I thought that'll be really pretty because you know I really love that for the fall. But that is the end of the haul. This is gonna be a little longer video, but please stick around. Um, like I said, if you're new, welcome, subscribe, hit that bell. You guys don't want to miss anything. But now on to my coffee bar. Super excited. This is where I had my command center and it just was too much because I thought that's what I wanted. But then I'm like, no, I really want a coffee bar. I did something like that for Christmas and I ended up purchasing these from it came with like four of these the baskets the little s hooks and i don't want to i want to say it was like 20 bucks something like that and it might have been from ltd lakeside one of those like online or book ordering stuff i love looking through them because they always have cute things and i grabbed that so we're going to hop into it. I'm going to show you what it looks like. Okay, guys. So, this is what I got going on. I left my recipe signs up there, which that I may paint over that and put coffee or coffee bar with my Cricut. So, I'll just give you an overview real quick. I love this. This little table. See how narrow this is, you guys? That's what we need, because this is a walkway. I went out, I got a Keurig. My uncle actually got me that for Mother's Day. He told me to treat yourself. So he got me that, and a lot of the other stuff I've had. Uh, the table is from LTD. I'm not that excited about it. It wasn't the best quality, but it's perfect for the size. So what I have up here, my Hello Sunshine, I was so excited with that. That little bee guy, he's from the Dollar Tree. You are my sunshine, it has yellow inside. Happy spring, cause we're still in spring. And yeah, my colors are a little different. The yellows aren't all quite the same, but I'm okay with that. And then I got my Queen Bee. That's the one that actually had the queen topper, then Busy Bee, and another one of those little bees. He's a pot hanger. You hang it on your pots. Then I have the queen bee. This is, I love this one. And the Busy Bee. So cute. And I don't know. I love them all. <laughs> and then these I bought at Hobby Lobby. And... It works perfect on here, you guys. So I put my straws there because you know I like to uh, stir my straws. My little honey. You guys saw these. Um, I think I shared those in a haul. Then I just put a little yellow candle in here. That's the topper. Then over here, that's one of my toppers. I think that's the one for the Busy Bee. That is from Hobby Lobby and a little house. I think that one was from Target at Christmas time. And of course, my cute little gnome with his beehive. And then, oh, see, Wolfgang's got to make or talk at least every video. Then I have my bee sweet, my honey sticks. 
I think the I think one is honey and one is lemon. And this actually, you guys, is a Ray Dunn. It's one of the older ones in the Curse of Writing. And then I just another one of those houses. My little bee mug. I really wanted to display him up a little higher. This right here, you guys. If you guys like the smell of Fruit Loops, this lemon sugar cookie smells just like Fruit Loops. No joke. It smells so good. And I got it from Kroger. And then my little sign, Coffee and Friends Make Perfect Blend. This has my little Keurig cups. I'm excited, you guys, because I've never had a Keurig. This right here is my sugar. This is the one I want to switch out. And then I just have a couple extra cups down here. Beautiful day. That has the yellow inside. And I just put one of my bee toppers. That, nope, nothing on that. Uh, the tea with the yellow handle. Um, new you, or New Year, New You, Hot Mess Express, and Happy Birthday, because that has the yellow in there also. So that's what I got going on. But I absolutely love how it turned out. I know this is a longer video, so hope you hopefully you guys stuck with, stuck it out with me. And uh, yeah, make sure you hit that subscribe button, comment below, tell me what your favorite was for my coffee bar. So I wanted to show you the guys this area real quick because this was the two tier tray that had all the bee stuff on it. So right now, this is what I ended up doing. Just a little something, it probably will change. Believe it or not, see those little bagels? Those are dog bones, but they, they look like little bagels. Then I have some lemons, my bee happy, these are all my little sp spatulas and stuff. I love those. And then I have my lemonade with some tulips. Okay, this is what I have in my other little corner. It's on my counter. That is a Ray Dunn, but I didn't want to see the words, believe it or not. Sometimes just too many words is too much for me. little truck carrying some lemons okay and here's the lemon one I have on my um, center why can't I talk you guys because that's just me center um, countertop so you guys, I'm looking at the time on here and I'm like, you know what? I'm going to make the two-tier tray decorate with me a separate video. So be on the lookout for that. These are some, this is one of them that I did that I did not take apart. So this goes on my island in my kitchen. But I think it turned out really cute. I hope you guys love this. Make sure you comment below. Let me know what you think of my bee and lemon theme in my kitchen. Next week I will have a home tour just to kind of go over everything. The pops of yellow. And I'll see you then. Make sure you be kind to one another. Love one another. See you next time. Guys, I forgot. I wanted to wish everybody a happy Mother's Day. I hope you guys have an amazing day that the loved ones in your life treat you like the queens you are. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to let you know that you guys have a great day. All right.